Hello everybody, my name is James, hope you're all doing well, and welcome back to another video. So it looks like Rebel and Verstappen are facing new problems, while Lewis Hamilton has made a new revelation about the W14. Make sure to like the video, and subscribe for more Formula 1 content, but let's jump straight into the news. So let's start with Red Bull, where Max Verstappen ended up retiring from qualifying. All weekend long Max has been so quick in Jeddah, and he's been in a league of his own, and going into qualifying, it looked like Max would take pole comfortably. But while he was so quick in Q1, he had a trouble Q2. I mean on his first run he got a big snap of oversteer which prevented him from completing the lap. And then on the second lap, after going through the first sector his car let him down. I mean it looked like at first he was slowing down because he wasn't happy with the lap. But then going on board it was clear there was something wrong with his car. I mean the replay showed the car just cut out whilst he was on full throttle. And this was due to a drive shaft failure. As a result he had to limp the car home. But while there was urgency from the mechanics to find the problem, there wasn't enough time, and as a result Max didn't set a time in Q2, and found himself down in 15th. Now Max did have downshift issues during practice. Nothing major, but nonetheless there were issues. And if you remember Bahrain, even though Rebel dominated the race, they did have issues in practice. So it does look like the car does have weaknesses, and it definitely cost Rebel in Jeddah, despite Sergio Perez taking pole. And speaking about the failure, Verstappen said, it's the first time I've heard about it. Coming out of turn 10 it happened, which is very annoying. I think so far we had a really good weekend, every session was going really well. Now it'll be more tricky to get to the front, but it's all about scoring points. So this does look like a new problem for Red Bull, and team boss Christian Horner said there wasn't a concern coming into the race. He told Sky F1, Something obviously has happened there and we need to get to the bottom of it, and understand it and make sure that it doesn't happen in the race. So it's clear Red Bull do have a long night ahead of them, but this does present a great opportunity for Aston Martin to win with Fernando Alonso. I mean, while Charles Leclerc is quick, he's got a grid job for the race. And in the other Ferrari, Carlos Sainz isn't looking that strong. Meanwhile, in the Mercedes camp, Hamilton did have a bad qualifying, but they have a chance to do something with George Russell, given he'll start the race from third. But Wolf was cautious ahead of the race. He said, We know the deficits we have. We need the big sets forward in the races to come. We should be pace-wise with the Ferraris, but Sergio Perez has a different car. Maybe with Max Verstappen's problem, Rebel have done it on purpose to win it all the way from the back. Now I don't think Verstappen is winning the race. I mean he's pulled off these types of drives before, but I do think it'll be harder to do this year. But I could see there being a great race between Perez and Alonso out in front, while Russell could potentially also get involved if the two slow each other down. But in regards to Hamilton, he's just not happy at all in the Mercedes. I mean he qualified almost four tenths down on his teammate, and speaking about Lewis's performance, Wolves said that that looked sticky in Sector 1, and the time never came together. But Hamilton has gone on to admit that he's unsure what to do to fix his current lack of connection with the W14. He said, I feel like I struggle with the car in the high speed corners particularly, but I just don't feel the car underneath me. I just don't feel connected to this car, and I can't get it, so I don't really know what I'm going to do about that. But what do you think? Let me know in the comments below. But that's going to be the video from me today. Thank you ever so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe for more videos. And until the next one, take care. Bye.